Stubb has discovered another home theater that's sure to make your local box office quiver in fear. With a perfect balance of luxury and usability, this theater screams celebrity status. The uh, screen research is acoustically transparent. It's a 100 inch wide screen. We've got a Vitacron DLP projector sitting above me. The whole system here in the house is Crestron controlled using a 10 inch uh, Wi-Fi touch panel. Um, we're using Halcro surround sound processing. Uh, we've got an HD DVD player and a couple of standard def DVD players. And this guy's a, he's a sports nut, so we've got server, we've got satellite, we've got cable in here. Powered by 10,000 watts and eight amplifiers, this place can really shake things up. We've got quite a bang here when we want it to, to light off. No argument there. With luxury theaters like this, it's hard to imagine that it gets much better. But it does, because TV is going 3D. People are watching movies in 3D. They're going to IMAX and watching movies in 3D. Those same studios that have made the movies for theater now want to take those movies and bring them to the home. So you're looking at a 73-inch Diamond DLP from Mitsubishi. It's a WD73833. It has a unique feature this year called 3D Ready, which allows you to now watch 3D content, whether it be movies or PC games. It's a very immersive experience. It draws you right into the action. Here in the demo, we're not only showing movies, we're showing sporting events like football, X Games. Actually, back in April of last year, the NBA All-Star Game in Las Vegas was done in 3D. Everyone that saw that was totally immersed in the experience. People have said, why do I need season tickets anymore? Basically, now I can just sit at home and be in the front row of the stadium. This is In Your Face TV, a viewing experience like never before, and all in the comfort of your own home theater. The best part? You can kick those old paper 3D glasses to the curb. That TV is actually sending those signals to this, this pair of glasses, as opposed to before where you had a red and green lens and you were creating 3D effect by those lenses. The, t the technology has advanced beyond that to the point where now you've minimized eye strain and any sort of vertical or headache impact. Mitsubishi's technology requires a DLP monitor containing tiny micro mirrors and other technologies to achieve a third dimensional viewing experience. You need a TV. Today, today you need a PC, you need special graphics cards, and certainly you need the content, whether it's PC games or movies. Going forward, we're looking at making it a Blu-ray experience. So now, as an example, you buy a 3D movie, put in your Blu-ray player, and now experience the 3D with this DLP television. DLP today has an engine inside of it that actually already, already splits the picture in half. And that engine already allows us to send the 60 hertz to each pair of, of lenses. LCD plasma cannot do that and probably will never be able to do that. So DLP as a technology is uniquely mature enough to give you this type of content in the home. What will it set you back? Well, including the 73 inch screen, the specs and all the essentials, you're looking at about $6,000. Just keep in mind, technology is always changing. After this, we're actually going to have the world premiere of laser television at CE Show. Laser television will take 3D to a brand new level. It's more vibrant, more colors, colors that you've never seen before. So if you think this is pretty cool, wait till you see laser with 3D. It's a whole new dimension of watching television. Television will never be the same again. Now, just imagine the home theaters of the future. Thank you for joining me on a tour of the best of home theaters. May you never wait in line at the movie theater again. I'm Cherie Woods, and I'll see you next time. Hey, can you keep it down? I'm trying to watch a movie. A nerve of some people.